What we do here is go back, 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 back. back. This is the like, it's not hot at all. Okay. And this is not hot. It's just the red ones aren't hot at all. Right. Yeah. So they start off, these are regular jalapenos. And then I mentioned this is another video too. That if you leave them on the, um, before you um, harvest them, if you keep them on, they'll individually change colors and they'll go from the traditional green and then they'll change. What's a good one? They'll start looking like this. See that? It's starting to turn red. And then this is probably a next step like that. And then they'll be completely red. So they vary in um, hotness or whatever. So the redder they are, the less hot they are. So anyway, so we are going to start this off. And what we're going to do is um the see these oh and i'm sorry i forgot to mention so i got the regular jalapenos and then i actually have a red a couple of red and green sweet peppers i wanted to see what those taste like with the cheese so that's what these are and this is from my little makeshift garden as well so there we go so we're going to start going to start yeah there you go right there and we split this up so we can get this i do this one too yeah so we're gonna i don't think we're gonna cook all of these so because i forget i cut them in half okay so we're gonna cut them in half <laughs> be careful Okay, and then we are going to cut all of them in half. Yeah, I don't think we're going to, yeah, I forget. We have them in half, so I'm not going to get all of them. And then we're just going to take the seeds out. Whatever. So we're going to do this for whatever the ones we're going to. And I'm going to today. Cook, and we will. I'm going to hang out with. Be back. We're going to hang out with Kenneth and people. Yeah, I know. I'm growing. Anyway, Anyways. we'll be back once we finish these up. Okay, so we are back and we are stuffing them now because all of them are seeded. And I got a couple that I've already started. I just wanted to make sure. So you can use the block cheese or, you know, the bl block cheese and just cut them into um you know sticks or you can use shredded i just chose to get sh the shredded cheese because it was on sale and i like tagento because it is um really really good cheese if you're not gonna get the expensive one anyway so she had a little yo incident okay so this is what happened y'all 
We ain't gonna take too much time on this now. So come on. Okay, what happened? I'm cutting the pepper, but you know, my eyes were bothering me because I, I don't know if it was in there because I was sneezing, right? So then, you know, after that, when I kept sneezing, I had rubbed my eye because, like, when I get allergies, they, <laughs> sorry, they, my eyes get watery. And then I rubbed my eye and then my, I was cutting the peppers, but then pep, the pepper got in both of my eyes and it sting and I fell on the floor and I hit my head and everything went black and then. Yeah. Okay, so I should have word of advice. And I could have went to the hospital because I had surgery on this eyeball if it, when I was little. It, I, I cut my cornea. That That's, wasn't surgery. It kind of was because <laughs> they stick something in my eyeball. That, was, that wasn't surgery. Anyway, use gloves, you know, to avoid, I guess, if you get distracted and you got to stop what you're doing to do something else because you have peppers on your hand. So that's what happened with her. Anywho, that's that. So we're going to finish stuffing these. And again, there's all the varieties of them I want to taste. And what I'm doing, if you get the shredded cheese, I'm just taking it, a little bit of it, and just- I'm not touching it, I need my gloves. <laughs> I'm too scared. My mouth, my whole face burns. So but the bad. peppers, are, I mean, the seeds are what makes it hot like that. We've already took the seeds out, so you're fine, actually. Um, so you can just do it like that. And then you take and it. Shush. And then you just, I'm going to get this on my floor. Mash it in there like, shoot, like so. Like a chef. And then, yeah, you just put push it into the halves. So I'll let her do that. Wait a minute. Here, do it. Take it so that it can stick. Take that off. And then mash it in your hand like that. And then stuff it in there. Anyway, and so then what we'll do is we'll take, you know, I'll just use this one as an example. And we have some flour here. My dad's gonna be like, you trying to kill my daughter. You know what? Okay. <laughs> anyway, so we take that, let it get on there real good, like so. Then you take it, and I'm gonna use my so bad. other hand for this one. And I'll take it, put it in the egg, roll it around round real good then Jeez. i'll switch hands here put that in the should i need, need some gloves hand me that paper towel right there behind you yeah this is, i've been using for my eyes girl i'm just playing i'm just, I'm just i did it i did it. <laughs> okay so anyway so then i'll take because this hand you know whatever so i'll take the breading and this is italian seek the italian um bread crumbs you can use plain if you like um, Graham i think the italian um flavor will give it a little bit more whatever now that could be it i think what i'm going to do just to make sure i'm going to oh that would that do this again 10 minutes just to wear off i'm going to double dip these so i'm gonna do it in the egg one more time and so then put it, the breadcrumbs and do it like that just to make sure it's a nice layer on there because what the idea is hopefully that the cheese don't seep out. And then it's going to look, ooh, her nose is bothering her now. Yeah, mm -hmm. now my nose is starting to bother. So it'll Wait look minute. like that. As you can see, it is covered. And we're going to put these on. I'll move this out the way. I'm gonna lay these out on the pan and so, and then you know we'll finish up the rest of them. And what'll oh. happen is you we'll put them in the um, refrigerator for a couple hours, and then from the, and that's to solidify. She used a big word that I don't even know. <laughs> that's not a big word. Anyway, to oh. solidify um the breading on there so that when you fry it it doesn't easily you know ooze out that's the idea of it 
and um yeah we'll do that for a couple hours and then we will fry my them. lips are so pink y'all need to get like me no smoky no cigarettes no nothing look at the white teeth stop playing me anyway we'll be back So here we go. She tasting. I did. I split them up into the hot and the sweet peppers, and then the the medium. So I got medium. So she got medium. And she, I'm not doing hot. I didn't do a dip with it, but she's using um cream cheese. Have you seen in the channel on TikTok? I use cream cheese and some hot takis. That's a treat. So this why that's why I got cream cheese. It just tastes the same. So oh my god, okay. hot. Oh, that's cheese? Yes. Girl. <laughs> oh. Okay, come on now. What, wrap this up. It's good. Cream cheese on it? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. yeah, you can do with it. I just didn't make a dip. So these are. Without it, it's still good. So one or two thumbs one, up. One or two? Three. Ooh. It's good. And it's pretty simple to make. And they all turned out looking really, really nice. Which was the hot one? Hot one. This one is the hot one. The, the so the one you had wasn't even hot. This right? one, right? It was like it wasn't even hot. Really. Like medium. Okay. And these are the sweet ones. The long ones. Oh, I'm trying the sweet one. I thought I had more though. More what? Of the sweet of, ones? Yeah. Yeah. Maybe I did. Oh, I probably did not make them. I ran out of cheese. Are you ready? Y'all have like the commercials. You can't even see that. They have the commercials. They. It's, okay. Wait. Okay. Mmm. The cheese. Oh. The steam. All right. So there we go. Three thumbs up from my PIC. There we go. She gonna be make these all the time now. All right. It's like okra. See y'all later, y'all. Peace. Peace.